our today's class with a problem. I have taken a problem, a circuit having a resistance of 12 ohm, an inductance point 1 by Henry and capacitance of 100 microfarad in series is connected across a 100 volts 50 hertz supply. Calculate the impedance, current, the phase difference between the current and supply voltage. We'll see how to proceed. We can find XL. First, we have to find XL. XL is equal to 2 pi FL. Values are known 2 into pi into 50 into 0.15, which is equal to 47.1238 ohms. Second one, XC. XC is equal to 1 by 2 pi FC. One by two pi F is fifty hertz into capacitance is hundred microfarad, hundred into ten raised to minus six is equal to thirty one point eight three ohms. Z is equal to R plus JXL, JXL minus JXC, you get Z value as 19.4389, 19.4389 at an angle 51.87. Ohms. After finding XL, X and Z, let us find the value current. Current I is equal to V by Z, which is equal to V is 100 at an angle 0, whole divided by Z value, just now we got 19.43 at an angle. 51.87, 51.87, together you get an value 5.14 at an angle minus 51.8, minus 51.8 amperes. As voltage is assumed reference, the phase difference between voltage and current is 51.8795 such that current lacks voltage. Therefore, cos phi is equal to cos phi is equal to cos of the angle 51.8795, which is equal to 0.6173 lagging. Power factor is lagging. This completes one problem. Next, let us go to the another problem. Three phase. So, let us move to the next one. Here, the next problem is related to three phase circuits. A star connected load consists of six ohm resistance in series with an eight ohm inductive reactance in each phase. A supply voltage of 440 volts at 50 hertz is applied to the load. Find the current power factor and the power consumed by the load. The first attempt we have to start with Z phase. Z phase is equal to 6 plus J8 ohms. Here, this becomes 10 at an angle 53.13. 53.13 ohms. Next, V phase is equal to 
v face is equal to v l by root three, which is equal to v l is four forty, four forty by root three. It becomes two fifty four point two fifty four point zero three four volts. Next, I phase is equal to V phase by Z phase. V phase by Z phase, which is equal to two fifty four point zero three four. Divided by Z phase ten at an angle fifty three point one three. So it may have it has become I phase, which is equal to twenty five point twenty five point four zero amperes. Next I L is equal to I phase, since it is star connected, which is equal to twenty five point. Four zero amperes. So here, cos phi is equal to r by z. Cos phi is equal to r by z. R value is six by ten, which is equal to point six. Point six lagging. So power is equal to root three v l i l cos phi. Root three v l i l cos phi. If you substitute V L I L formula here, we get total power eleven point six one kilowatts. So this completes the problem on the problem related to three phase.